In other news, the Ghana Medical Association says the position of the Ghana Association of Medical Laboratory Scientists not to allow laboratory physicians to work at hospitals is a breach of the Provisions Act 857. Now, addressing a press conference in Kofodia in the Eastern Region, President of the Association, Dr. Frank Ankobia, said claims by the medical laboratory scientists was worrying. According to the president of the Ghana Medical Association, Dr. Frank Ankopia, the Ghana Association of Medical Laboratory Scientists has deliberately misinterpreted the provisions of the Health Professions Regulatory Bodies Act 2013, Act 857, and added the assertion that laboratory physicians cannot work at hospital laboratories, which is not grounded in law. At the teaching hospitals, both the technologists and laboratory physicians are needed and it should be left with the employer to determine who does what in the laboratory. The head of the laboratory should be somebody who understands and can interpret the science, but it's primarily a management position. The headship of the laboratory is a management decision and should not be interfered with by any institution. The GMA demands laboratory physicians who have been forced out of their workplaces at the Konfanochi Teaching Hospital, the Kolebu Teaching Hospital and the Cape Coast Teaching Hospital to be reinstated with immediate effect. All other forms of threats, including but not limited to murder and bodily harm, harassment and assault directed at these laboratory physician residents and specialists, should cease forthwith. The GMA takes a serious, a very serious view of these otherwise criminal activities at the workplace that are directed towards our members by the medical laboratory scientists. The Ministry of Health and the various hospital management should also ensure the swift prosecution of the perpetrators of these crimes. The association served notice to the Ministry of Health and its allied agencies to address their resolutions or be prepared to face drastic actions which could disturb industrial harmony. If this current ongoing continue, we have no option than to insist that at all times, irrespective of the site that the results are coming from, there should be formal authorization by a physician we can communicate with. You should also remember that ultimately the doctor is the one who holds the responsibility for the holistic care of the patient. He is the one who will be called to answer if things go wrong. And the doctor has a duty to ensure that in the chain, everything that comes to him is very clear and well understood in the context of the proper management of patients. In the past week, the Ghana Association of Medical Laboratory Scientists has embarked on strike after the laboratory physicians were posted to the laboratory of the Konfanochi Teaching Hospital in Kumasi.